Welcome to Cattle Mills ISD. This video was created to show parents and guardians how to enroll students that will be new to our district. There are three easy steps to get started. One is to give some basic information. Two is to check your email. Three is to log in and complete all forms. Let's get into the details for each of these steps. In step one, the enrolling parent or guardian will need to click on the enrollment link and complete some basic information that will help Skyward build an account. All fields marked with an asterisk are required and must be added. Please be sure to include an active email that you can check later for information. When all information is complete and entered, please click Submit at the bottom of the screen. In Step 2, the enrolling parent or guardian will check the email used in Step 1 for a message from Skyward or no reply at cattlemillsisd.org. This email is important because it contains your username and a link to change your password and log in to the Skyward account. In step three, the enrolling parent or guardian will begin the enrollment steps. You do this by logging in to Skyward and clicking on the down arrow next to the little house and choosing the new student enrollment option. To officially begin enrollment, you will click the green tile that says 2022-23 new student and the grade level you are enrolling. Notice that there are two tiles. One tile is for grades 7 through 12th grades and the other tile is pre-K through 6th grade. Be careful to choose the correct tile because it is difficult to transfer information from one campus to another. Once you click on the tile that, you're, that is correct for your student, you will then click on the Start button, choose the school you are enrolling the student, and save. You will continue throughout all of the steps to complete the new student enrollment. It will be helpful to read any directions given if they are available because they provide explanations and expectations that are needed. You may stop and resume your progress as many times as necessary. It is not necessary to save your information because the system automatically saves it for you. The next time you log in to the new student enrollment, you will see an orange tile that says In Progress 2022-23 New Student. You may click this tile to continue completing the forms. However, the campus will not receive your information about enrollment until all steps are complete and you have reviewed and submitted the form. Also, if for any reason you are unable to upload any of your required documents, you're encouraged to take them to the appropriate campus and we will be happy to copy the required papers for you. And that's it. That's all it takes to enroll a new student. It's pretty easy. If you have any questions or need any additional help, please contact the campus you're enrolling your student.